Hi, this is Auto Amateur Bob again here. I'm going to be showing you how to save some more money. I just showed you how to uh, compound out the paint on the truck. Now I'm going to show you how to take all of this oxidation out of your headlights. Uh oh, police are after me again. I wonder if that was about those songs I was stealing off the internet. Anyway, stay away from LimeWire. Now I'm going to uh, show you guys how to take oxidation out of these headlights. And uh, one of these headlights at Pick and Pull can run you between $20 to $30 a piece. I just went there to buy a lens. cost me $26 for my Mustang. Outrageous, huh? Brand new one, you can just imagine that's going to run you about $90. So for $5 or less, I'm going to show you how to take all the oxidation out. We're going to be using the same materials. Buff pad I just liberally... Uh, you know, clean just so there ain't no uh, dirt in it. We're going to be using that 3M rubbing compound, the heavy stuff, the 1200. A misting bottle over here. And this is going to take a lot less time than it would to buff out paint. What I do is apply it directly to your hand and just work it in there like this. You want to get it everywhere. Now these little indentions right here, got to watch out for those. That can tear up your buffer pads, so you want to work around them, not through them. And again, always clean your compound, not on your clothes, but on your buff pad. I'm going to hit it with the mister real fast to activate the cutting cutting chemicals in this now I wouldn't worry too much about the color getting onto the glass or plastic that will all just wash right off now I'm going to apply more of this cutting compound but you know what? Actually, I'd like to get a, a better, I'd like to get a better shine out of it. So, I'm actually going to use second stage. I'm not going to use as much this time around, but I'm going to get in there real good. Now, you don't want to be spinning your buffer too fast while doing things like this because it takes away from how much you're actually cutting into. One miss will do it. Take it down to the slowest speed. As you can see, within a few minutes, you can get a nice, clean, look in a headlight for a fraction of the cost. Wipe down some of this leftover polish. Comes right off. I wouldn't leave it on. It might embed itself into your headlight. But this solves a lighting issue and a money issue all in one crack. This is Auto Amateur Bob here, signing off.